how's it going? I hope you all are doing amazing. If you're new here, hello. Welcome to my channel. I'm the Intuitive Rose. Nice to meet you. If you're not new here, hello and welcome back. I'm so happy you joined me again today. So today, y'all, we're going to do a pick a card reading on what is secretly being hidden from you and what are they secretly hiding, okay? So we do have three piles for you to choose from today. We have pile number one, pile number two, and pile number three. All right, and if you feel drawn to, feel free to choose more than one. That's again, only if you feel drawn to. Okay, so we have pile number one, pile number two, and pile number three. All right, so if you chose pile number one, this is your reading, pile number one. So let's see what secrets are being hidden from you and what secrets are they hiding, okay? So first message that I get was that you guys could be dealing with someone who you are romantically invested in or maybe you're just curious about, you know, you're curious about the connection or some sort. So I did get the channel message that this person may actually be hiding the fact that you feel very familiar to them because even like looking at this image you guys it's just something about this being you know at home but then it also feels like it's misplaced at the same time because there's like water and a sunset behind it so it's like giving fantasy daydream stuff like that so i do feel like someone is hiding the fact that they do fantasize about this that they are romantically interested in you but something is like again like a fantasy or maybe this person is hiding that they feel like you are out of their league like this is too good to be true or you know it would never go there okay <clears throat> I do feel like what's being hidden from you is that someone really does um look at you in a in a light okay like you really may may be this person's weakness okay next message um i did write down that someone is denying a bond that you two have okay so there's also something about deja vu here okay maybe this could be why like this is too good to be true or this is also probably why they're hiding it it's it's like they're it feels familiar but it also may scare them too okay yeah, I'm now hearing that song, um, Disturbia by, by Brianna. And I'm hearing the part when she's like, why do I feel like this? Okay, so yeah, it could be disturbing too. I don't know. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Yeah, I feel like whoever this is about, you guys, you may, this may actually scare them, like really scare them because they may fantasize about this a lot. Like it becomes obsessive. Okay. They may feel like they are, you know, delusional as well. Like, they're making all this up, okay? Like, ain't no way you could be interested in me, okay? So, I really do feel like this is what's being hidden from you is that someone just views you in this high light. Like, you are, you know, someone of high standards, high class, and, you know, they may suffer from insecurity. So, if you do or you have vocalized this interest in to this person, they may find it to be, you know, a little suspect, okay? <laughs> All right, I did also write down, someone is hiding that they feel like you are their soulmate, so confirmation right there. I'm hearing nonchalant, okay? Um, it's a lot of hiding, okay? That's what I feel, just a lot of hiding of how they feel deep down, okay? Okay, this actually haunts them is what I'm getting. I did write down that it's a lot of daydreaming going on, which makes me think that this person, again, fantasizes about you. I did mention that. They may even find your, you know, again, out of their league, too good to be true. And Spirit was also giving me some insight on like depression or deep wounds that this person suffers from, okay? And this could be why I was hearing that Rihanna song, Disturbia. So this, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so this is what's being hinted for me, that this person actually suffers from, um, you know, maybe they had a past of 
thinking, oh, this was a good connection with someone or things was going well and it ended up, you know, going downhill. So it feels like they may be traumatized by that. They still carry wounds. They still carry burdens. And this is what's being hidden from you. Maybe they have not discussed this with you or maybe, you know, maybe this is something that they still haven't figured out, honestly. But I do feel like this person's hiding the fact that they are very, like, fantasizing about you, okay? You know how they say, like, you know, be Delulu. I feel like this person feels like they really are being delusional when, in fact, this may actually be a mutual feeling. Like, you two may mutually have the same interest in one another, okay? <clears throat> so, yeah, depression, deep wounds. All right, and I also did write down for some of you, this person's hiding that they struggle with their weight, okay? So, you know, this could be maybe losing too much weight or this could be gaining too much weight, okay? So take it how it may resonate with you, all right? But I did get the message in regards to weight, all right? I do feel like this may refer to you know, this connection may be weighing heavy on them, but they're not really telling you. They're not really discussing how you really make them feel, how being around you, you know, is like a safe place for them, okay? A lot of, um, I'm getting the message that a lot of the things you say to them, it just, it's like, feels very safe. It feels very pleasing. And also, again, there's something about um, something being very familiar to them and it's possible this is what like maybe an ex of theirs did like you know they was feeling the same things and then all of a sudden again you know it went downhill so this could be what's scaring them the fact that they oh they've been there before they felt like this before and you know when they felt like this you know again it did not go as planned okay as expected all right I feel like this person is really hiding that they may suffer from self-sabotaging or again like they just still have things that they have to heal from okay um and i did write down that the masculine okay so yeah if you guys look at this image you see how the masculine like is more covered than the female yeah okay so this again tells me that one person could be more open to this connection than the other so like this may be a masculine that you're dealing with or it could be a feminine take it how it resonates but there's definitely someone present here that is more closed off but they're still you know abundant rising my loves thank you so much for being open to listening to this reading today if you find yourself to be resonating with these channel messages and would love to finish the remainder Feel free to become a Patreon member to have full access to the rest of your reading plus more. You also have the option of renting the remainder for only $1 today. If interested, feel free to follow the steps in the description box below to have a private link sent to you. I kindly thank you in advance for your love and true support. All right, so if you chose paw number two, this is your reading paw number two. So let's see what is secretly being hidden from you and what secrets are they hiding, okay? So you guys, I must give a trigger warning. As y'all can see, this image, I had to hide it, honestly, um, because even I am like getting a little sad over this okay so first and foremost some of you guys could be dealing with maybe a family member or you could be dealing with someone like you're talking to like it feels like an early stage like I'm hearing early on so maybe again this is like a family member or this is someone you're you just met you just started talking to so spirit is making me um, think of things that this person has gone through early in life hence the child here okay so before I even read these channel messages I'm about to just like give the insight on what like I was getting overall from this image you guys so whoever you're dealing with or maybe whoever you're around again I'm getting family member so just take how it may resonate with you Pond number two but 
I do feel like this person may have been abused, okay? Abused. And this is what's being hidden from you. Um, and this may be a secret that's being, like, hidden. Like, someone is hiding that they have suffered from abuse, okay? And this abuse could be many different things. But I do feel like one of them is for sure neglect, okay? Because even, like, looking at this this baby and there's, like, rib cage showing. So, this person was hungry. This person was starving, okay? This could be actually starving, like, for hung like hungry or this could be in regards to maybe starving for their parents love for their affection you know stuff like that wanting to be seen all right I do feel like this is the overall secret here this is what's being hidden okay this could also be like a close friend of yours like they may suffer from this okay um, I'm getting the, like, spirits is um, talking about triggers and stuff. So if you may notice that this person just gets triggered easily, and it, it is because of that, okay? They suffer from things that they went through in childhood, okay? All right. So that's what I was getting from the overall image. I'm going to read you guys the channel messages. So if any of you guys are talking to someone, I do feel like spirit... Um, is giving the message that this person may have a child, okay? And this, this is what's being hidden. For some of you, this could be that they once had a child. So someone could have lost a child here. And this may be, um, this may be like a, a secret, like in the closet thing, okay? So this could be from previous connections. I'm hearing a first marriage. Okay, so maybe the um, person that they were first married to, okay? Um, so yeah, take it how it resonates with you, but there's definitely something in regards to having a child here, okay? Or maybe this could be like someone was once pregnant, but they either lost the baby, okay? Next message was, someone is hiding that, okay, that their past still haunts them, okay, yeah. So even looking at this image, you guys, this person... I'm seeing him push this baby in this mirror as if, again, secrets, like stay in the closet, like stay in this mirror. Like, I don't I don't want to deal with this. OK, so this may be another thing that's being hidden from you. I do feel like you may be talking to someone or interacting with someone that does not like to deal with things that they really should be dealing with. OK, this may be why spirit was giving me the message about triggers and stuff like you may notice that this person becomes easily triggered. And that could be why this person has not dealt with a lot of trauma that they have been through. OK, um, I feel like they hide a lot of things and they it's almost like they keep pushing it away like further and further away and it may you know show in like their their character and stuff like that okay yeah and this was the only like picture that is like all this black is surrounded by i'm sorry it's all this black surrounding like this whole image here so that may be relevant maybe this person likes to wear a lot of black or maybe there's something dark about this person that you just can't put your finger on and this could be what it is that this person really does keep things like on the low like they they do not like people in their business all right they're very secretive okay and I do feel like it will probably take a lot to um, get this person to reveal all these things okay and it's not just you spirit is telling me to like don't take it personal okay because it feels like even the people close to them don't really know this person okay yeah all right, next message. Where was I at? Okay, someone could have reoccurring dreams, okay? So, yeah. Thank you, Spirit. All right. So, if you are talking to someone or maybe you're around someone that has, <laughs> excuse me, that has problems sleeping, this could be why, all right? Someone has really bad nightmares or um, 
someone may be having the same dream over and over and over and you see what I mean how this goes back to someone is not dealing with something so they're like pushing this away and it's they're just pushing it further and further and further and it seems like the universe is giving them these messages or this um, these energies in different things so maybe in different people different lessons in life so different interactions at work like that's just an example you guys because they're not dealing with the root trauma here okay so this person definitely could like have insomnia okay or just I don't know really bad I don't know that it feels like they cannot sleep okay this person may suffer from night sweats okay all right, next message. All right, so I did write down that this person hides the fact that they still have a lot of growing up that they have to do, okay? I do feel like this person um, Abundant did not... rising, my loves. Thank you so much for being open to listening to this reading today. If you find yourself to be resonating with these channel messages and would love to finish the remainder, feel free to become a Patreon member to have full access to the rest of your reading plus more. You also have the option of renting the remainder for only $1 today. If interested, feel free to follow the steps in the description box below to have a private link sent to you. I kindly thank you in advance for your love and true support. All right, so if you chose pawn number three, this is your reading, pawn number three. So let's see what is secretly being hidden from you um, and what secrets are they hiding, okay? So pawn number three, the first thing that I wrote down was a song by Destiny Child. I was hearing the chorus part um, from one of their songs. It's like, I don't think you're ready for this jelly. It was something like that. And I think in that song, she was like, because this body is so bootylicious. Okay. <clears throat> so, part number three, what's being hidden from you? Someone is actually checking you out. Okay. I feel like someone secretly checks you out a lot. All right. Um, this is giving like, you know, you, know, you may be really oblivious to this. Okay. Because Spirit was showing me someone in the mirror, you know, getting dressed, you know, but you know checking their outfit and stuff like that but then there's someone at the door like looking you know something like that could be relevant <laughs> all right I do feel like um what's being hidden from you is that someone actually really does like your body okay there's definitely something about like a uh, change in your your physique um okay it could be anything like you know maybe you're losing weight or maybe you're putting on weight okay um, next message. What's being hidden from you is that there is actually someone that is putting off making a move towards you. All right. I don't feel like this move is going to be made <laughs> like anytime soon or maybe ever, honestly, because it just, I don't know, like the energy that I was feeling was like, this person may never admit or this person may never like like make any sort of attempt okay something like that here i was also seeing one 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 all right one 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 two 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 could be relevant as well okay um yeah so also i did write down something about king neptune all right because i was seeing his fork or whatever it's called i don't know Whatever his stand is called that looks like a fork, a <laughs> pitchfork or something like that. I was seeing that. So that may be relevant to you guys. All right. This wasn't King Neptune a dad. So yeah, it's like something about. Okay. Yeah, there's definitely something about like a father figure here. Okay. Um. I feel like this father figure, they could be, like, trying to, hmm, that could be why I was getting something about, like, hiring. I'm not sure. Maybe you guys work with your dad or maybe your dad, like, works somewhere that they're hiring or something like that. And they may be hiding the fact that they're hiring, okay? It feels like someone is, like, putting something off. <laughs> I don't know what this is, though, but a, a father figure is relevant, okay? Okay. 
it almost feels like you know someone may not want you working with them you know because of the fact that you look good <laughs> so they know like oh no too much attention is going to be brought to paw number three I don't want that kind of attention here like something like that here so if you notice maybe you spoke to a hiring manager and they didn't you know they basically was like oh we're not hiring or we'll contact you you know we'll get back to you it's pretty much that like the reason for them turning you down is because you look great your body is so again destiny child bootylicious okay so somebody definitely um judged you based off of your looks also something of in regards to tattoos may be relevant as well okay I do feel like a father is judging you as well. Like, Spirit's making me go back to that King Neptune. So, clearly, I didn't give the the all the message here. All right? So, what's being hidden from you is that there's a father judging you, okay? It could be maybe because you're not working, all right? Because there's definitely something about someone not hiring so maybe this is something that you're saying and they're they may feel like you know you're just trying to sit down dine out all day and just be free all day like something like that here they may um be trying to figure out like what you do for work or if you're really actually looking for work something like that is relevant okay <clears throat> Also, I did pick up on someone going undercover to look for um, people, you know, who have great talent, great quality, you know, great skill set. So definitely be mindful if like someone is like reaching out to you or maybe, you know, this may be someone on social media, something like that here. Okay. Um, definitely treat your clients well. If you have a service that you do offer to the public, all right? Spear was uh, giving the message that there is a undercover um, boss, okay, coming towards you, okay? Yeah, this feels really good, actually. This feels like maybe this could be someone that could offer you something that could grant you you know, more freedom, more financial freedom, more freedom to be with your, you know, with your spouse or more freedom to be with your children. Something like that is relevant. Okay. So let's pull from tarot. I actually didn't get many channel messages for you guys, <clears throat> which tells me that I was meant to just pull more cards. All right. So let's see. Pound number three spirit. What is secretly being hidden from them? What secrets is this person hiding? All right. Yeah, I do feel like you guys may really get judged a lot based off your appearance. All right. We have six of pentacles. Hmm. Quality time. Then we have the king of cups. It's in reverse. Oh, wow. What's being hidden from you is that there is someone that notice your withdrawal okay because the the um king of cups is in reverse all right i do feel like someone has emotionally withdrawn from someone all right you have not been investing maybe messaging interacting talking to someone and what's being hidden is that this person is feeling that okay that this person um there's something about clocking i, I really don't know i feel like a lot of you guys may have like a father figure that like watches you like clocks your every move okay this may be like an unhealthy um attachment as well like this father may be controlling Abundant rising my loves thank you so much for being open to listening to this reading today if you find yourself to be resonating with these channel messages and would love to finish the remainder feel free to become a patreon member to have full access to the rest of your reading plus more. You also have the option of renting the remainder for only $1 today. If interested, feel free to follow the steps in the description box below to have a private link sent to you. I kindly thank you in advance for your love and true support. Love and light.